you guys working on this house. We need to get inside. There's a girl trapped in the sauna. What girl? This place is empty. We've been here all day working on the foundation. Can you let us inside to check? Yeah, sauna's through that door. Lucy, cut these hinges. We're going to have access in a second. Okay, Cap. Power with gas is off. All right, let's get that door off. Pulse is steady. Pretty severe contusion on her head. Most likely looking at a concussion. Third degree burns to 45% of her face. We're gonna have to debris to start separating the flesh from the rocks. Sailing ready. Right. Oh, my God. I'm gonna try to pull her off. Oh, oh hold God. Hold it, hold it, hold it right there. Three. Okay. Dispatch notify First Presbyterian. We're 10 minutes out. Have the specialty burn unit standing by. She's on her way to the burn unit now. High price to pay for living a fake life. You think a regular life was that bad? Maybe she felt like she was missing out on a life she could have had if she'd been born someone else or made different choices. Don't you wonder about stuff like that? Not really. Well, some people, most people, other than you, <laughs> worry that they're not getting the full experience. You know, the unknown is scary, you know, FOMO. <laughs> Fear of missing out? You make it sound like a sickness. I guess it kind of is. Yeah. Told you so. Yes. She likes to squeeze that thing like it's a stress ball, don't you? She didn't even care that she was covered in two clothes. Oh, baby, it's okay. Oh, there you go. Oh, honey, there you go. What's this? Why is her baby box out? Uh, I just found some stuff I brought back from Boston. I won't put it in there. Wow. It's a lot of memories. Uh, you should see the camera roll on my phone. It's like a flip book. Watch the baby grow right before your eyes. I miss so much. Hey, it's okay. That's where I tried to document everything. So you could catch up. Thanks. It's really sweet of you. Let's go, messy baby. Okay. <laughs> 